Hey guys, welcome back, Pascal here, and today I'm super excited because uh, I'm gonna react to a short animation called Mr. Carefree Butterfly. Now the reason I'm excited is because the creator of this short is Yana Tental. Now if you guys have been following us uh, for some time, we've made a, another reaction video of a short called Aquarium, which was also made by Yanathan, and Aquarium turned out to be uh, one of our all-time favorites. I'm super curious what uh, this short's gonna be about. Um, actually, it was his uh, graduation film, and the description, all it says of the video is, a carefree millennial helps his friend to move to the suburbs. But before we dive into it, I just wanna say a big thank you to our Patreon supporter, Norman Cross. Norman, if you're watching, thank you so much for your support. It is greatly appreciated. It's because of uh, your generosity and all of our Patreon supporters that we can do what we do here on this channel so thank you so much for that now without waiting anymore let's jump into it I'm super excited let's go all right just a few hours out nothing crazy a drink some dancing and back home gotta wake up at Eight. We're gonna set that now. But why are you so pretty? Love the voice. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Shit! Fuck! This is bad. This is bad. Fuck! Shit! Fuck! Shit! Fuck! <gasps> okay. Psst. Add me on Facebook. <laughs> Hey, I am so, so, so sorry, man, but I'm here now. And Do you I ever still... check your phone? I, I did. I, I just, I forgot to charge it. I wasn't at home. Never mind. I'm sorry. I'm oh, here. It smells like you had fun last night. Oh, my God. Get in here. Is Katie here? No, she went grocery shopping. So, this is it? Yeah. Wow. It's a... Uh... It's a nice layout, man. It's like a it's like a house. It's like a house. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny me owning a house, huh? Oh, it's hilarious. You own this wall. You own a fireplace, another wall. Uh, no, actually, I will own this house after 30 years of mortgage. Whoa. 30 years? <laughs> You're gonna spend 30 years inside these walls? Please, don't get it started, okay? Oh my God. This reminds me of how you were on my wedding day. You realize that it means you'll have to go to bed with her every night for the rest of your life. Yep. Even though she's the third girl you slept with. <laughs> Speak now or forever hold your peace. I object! <laughs> just kidding. I'm, I'm just kidding. Oh, oh my god. Go on. <laughs> Come on, man, say it. I just... Spit it out. You think this is the most boring thing I could be doing I, right now? I don't think it's the most boring. I, 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 I think it's the most boring. It's the most boring. Because what about life? You spent your most beautiful years stuck in a library, studying a generic degree, while I have been all over the world, tearing it up, testing my limits, making mistakes, and trying a bunch of different things, because I knew that this is the time to live it up. Before your wife tells you what to do. Before your boss tells you what to do. Before you get a mortgage. But you were so afraid to leave your comfort zone, so you rushed through the only time in your life you can be completely free! Hey, stop! Uh, God, I thought you could just be happy for me. I am, I'm just- You don't have to like this. This is my life, okay? I worked really hard to get this, man, and you come in here and you laugh at it? God, and you're late. <sighs> you know, you go do your thing. Go be Mr. Carefree Butterfly. I don't care. I just, I just, I don't want you to wake up in a few years and realize that you haven't made anything. Because that's terrifying. All right, uh, 
I think I'm gonna go. I'm, I'm sorry. Again. Hey! Uh, hey! Look who decided to show up. I, I was actually just about to leave. What? Are you kidding me? No, you're staying for dinner. No, yeah, really, I... You go up and you take a warm shower. You smell like you had fun last oh night. Oh my god. <laughs> Now, seriously, uh, this was uh, an amazing short yet again. It's even better than Aquarium, uh, in my opinion. And you can see it uh, in the animation, in the colors, in the music, in the dialogues. Everything is uh, so well made. Uh, it's a fantastic uh, story. The characters are extremely relatable. I loved the voice acting in it. Uh, the voices were all great. Dialogues were super like down to earth and real and uh loved uh all you can see you can get a sense of the the character like his personality it was uh it was so colorful and it fit with the whole art style i felt so uh, uh i guess my favorite scene was the wedding scene because it was just so funny but then again i really liked uh the interaction between the main character and his friend who are like polar opposites in terms of lifestyles and when his friend tell him uh, that he just fears that his friend is gonna like wake up and realize in several years that he has accomplished nothing, that was super deep. And you can get a sense that his friend really cares for him. And I love that at the end, uh, you can sense that the, the main character, his opinion is changing on life and that he's maybe considering doing something more constructive. But uh, all in all, I felt it was a beautiful short. Jonathan, if you're watching, thank you so much for making these. Uh, these shorts are absolutely wonderful. Keep doing them. Guys, please go. Uh, there's going to be a link in the description box below to the original video and to Jonathan Tao's channel. Click on them. Go check out his channel. Go check out his videos. Give him uh, likes and love because this work is amazing. And thank you so much for watching. If you guys have any other recommendations you want to give to me, just do so in the comment section below. I'm going to look at them and make a list out of them. So guys, thank you so much for watching and we're going to see each other this Saturday. Bye guys. Love you so much.